driving and hiking Santa Clara Truck Trail. From the 14 freeway in Santa Clarita, take the Placerita Canyon exit. Drive east to Sand Canyon Road, where you continue south to Santa Clara Truck Trail on the left. The drive is 7.9 miles from the 14 freeway. The visit consists mostly of a drive on a forest road and hikes to a few easy summits. Santa Clara Truck Trail reopened after a long closure. I wanted to check it out from the west side first before driving it. After walking it for 1.5 miles, I went back to the car and started driving it. There was some traffic due to hunting season. The road is paved all the way to Magic Mountain, 7 miles total. I shot no video on Magic Mountain, but continued driving another 14 miles to Messenger Flats Campground. The road was unpaved after Magic Mountain. Once at the campground, I hiked toward Messenger Peak. The hike combined the road with a short summit trail. With the car doing most of the work, the difficulty rating for the hike is easy. Backtracking toward the peak by walking the road. Picking up the peak access route. Finding the use trail the rest of the way. Eventually, aiming for the highest point is the way to go. Approaching the summit. On the summit of Messenger Peak. And here it is, the register. Right in here. Confirmation, Messenger Peak. Yeah. Heading back down. Next, a trip to Lightning Point Group Campground. The hike is a rather straight line from the parking area. The difficulty rating is very easy. Walking through the campground to Rocky Benchmark. The route is paved half of the way. Leaving the road and picking up the use trail. Instead of showing a summit clip, I shot it on the false summit due to a hunter occupying the true summit. Necessary hunting season sacrifices.
looking toward Mount Gleason. Concluding Rocky Benchmark. Next up is Mount Gleason. Looking at Rocky Benchmark from the Mount Gleason parking area. Summiting Mount Gleason is just a matter of following a flat paved road. The difficulty rating is very easy from this starting point. Beginning the Mount Gleason hike. The paved road has been unmaintained for years. Approaching the summit. Veering off the road to reach the highest point. On the summit of Mount Gleason. Wrapping up the hiking. Once back at the car, the road goes 10 more miles to Angeles Forest Highway. In total, a 31-mile drive. The ride ends at Angeles Forest Highway. Mission accomplished.